Bloom's report is about information processing theory. It's a cognitive theory that focuses on how information is encoded into our memory. The theory describes how our brains filter information from what, what we're paying attention into the present moment to what gets stored in our short-term or working memory and ultimately into our long-term memory. Developed by American psychologists including George Miller in 1950s, information processing theory has in recent compared in human brain to a computer. George A. Miller has provided two theoretical ideas that are fundamental to cognitive psychology and the information processing framework. So the first concept is chunking and the capacity of short-term memory. Miller presented the idea that short-term memory could only hold 5 to 9 chunks of information where a chunk is any meaningful unit. A chunk could refer to digits, words, chess positions, and other faces. The concept of chunking and the limited capacity of short-term memory became a basic, basic element of all subsequent theories of memory. So the second concept is 2T or Test Operate Test Exit proposed by Miller, Galanter, and Pribram. Miller suggested that 2T should replace the stimulus response as the basic unit of behavior. In 2T unit, a goal is tested to see if it has been achieved and if not an operation is performed to achieve the goal. These cycles of tests operate is repeated until the goal is eventually achieved or abandoned that duty. So, principles of information, information processing theory. So, the first principle is short-term memory is limited to seven chunks of information. Second, planning is a fundamental cognitive process. So the third one is behavior is hierarchically organized. So yun lang po ma'am. Thank you.